Let's start again Hello my little llamas, it is Klizmi here and welcome back to my channel Today, or welcome Anyway, <laughs> today I am starting the very first part of my City Living Let's Play, which is super duper exciting because, uh, because it's City Living, <laughs> that's why. So we have two Sims in this Let's Play, I'm just so excited. In my current household, at the moment, we have exactly eight Sims because we had two sets of triplets. <laughs> huh. It's a lot of work, and right now, like, the Sims just, they're like, image size thingies are so huge because my current household they're all so small and I like don't even know who's who but anyway so I'm very excited for this let's play obviously I've played around with city living in my own time just so I can kind of get a feeling of how to play it and really show you in the let's play not really just kind of learn it but I'm also learning stuff with you so I guess we'll kind of see but anyway <laughs> so we have two sims like I said the first sim is the main sim right here with the purple hair, which is awesome. But <laughs> anyway, this is, well, okay, let's just go back. Um, this is Lavender. So the first part is always quite a bit of talking, so I apologize if I rant or go on about something for too long. But that's, that's just going to happen. It's bound to happen. But anyway, so Lavender is very artistic. Her kind of aspiration, I guess, or dream is to live in an... Um, in a penthouse in like the artistic area and she's like pretty outgoing I guess and hold on let's just go over to her and let's just check out her trades because I don't remember them because I made her quite a while ago so she's creative she's vegetarian and she's jealous so some pretty interesting traits the vegetarian is new and then her aspiration or with her, her aspiration she got home turf kind of trait thingy so that's new and then her aspiration is new as well which is city native so that's all good and well her style is pretty artistic as well it's pretty different there's going to be some of her outfits that will kind of change every once in a while that will be pretty exotic i guess you could say pretty out there so that's interesting and for her career i don't think i've gotten her one now but i want her to do the art critic career and then we'll also do quite a bit of painting and then this is her good friend Demi they met I would say like maybe a year ago and then Demi lived with her parents and Lavender did as well and I'll actually tell you about their parents a little bit later on but um, anyway Lavender or sorry Demi actually decided to move with Lavender since she was moving with away from her parents and I did have like a whole backstory written out, but I unfortunately like I cannot find my notebook with all my ideas and it's really upsetting because it has like everything in there for my channel and it's really annoying. But last week, yeah, yeah, last week, I think, or the week before, no, last week, I wasn't around at my house, so I had brought it with me and now I have no clue what I did with it. So that's annoying. But anyway. So, Lavender's parents are actually extremely wealthy. She does have a brother as well. They aren't in the safe, so I don't think it will show in her, um, in her family tree. Oh, it does? Oh, no, it doesn't. But, anyway, she does have two parents and a brother. And her brother is just a teenager. He's younger than her, so he's still living with them, and he's actually following definitely following his father which lavender does not like she's not at all like her family she often fights with them a lot and she doesn't want her brother to become one of them because they're just rich all they really care about is money he's a really popular politician he used to be mayor of san Myshuno. and so yeah that's kind of how her brother's future is looking and she doesn't like the sound of that so we might kind of dabble into that as well and Demi's parents are just regular parents. She has a twin brother as well, which I... Have I placed him? Oh, yeah, because I, could, I don't have my notebook, so I don't remember this stuff. But her brother actually lives in one of these two apartments. Um, I don't remember which one, but it should show in her family tree, unless I forgot to make them siblings. Okay, I did. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> but 
but anyway, point is, is that her brother does live in this apartment complex, and that's another reason that she decided to move in with, um, with Lavender, because, you know, her brother lived in the same apartment, so, yeah, uh, that's pretty cool, I think that we can get started with gameplay and stuff, but first, I gotta show you their apartment, so their apartment is super colorful and super awesome, I love it a lot, but first of all, this is what you walk into, I just really like their apartment, I think that it's really nice, and yeah, so... This is obviously the living space. They don't have too, too much, but they have a pretty nice space. I like it quite a bit. Just, yeah, pretty neutral. And then we have the living room here. This is when the color starts kind of popping in. You can see the rugs that look like um, doilies. <laughs> you, We have a bookshelf and just some colorful stuff. I really like it. And then here, if we just back up a little bit, it's like this pretty thin sort of hallway thing that you can go over here and then there is a door oh two doors bah, bah, bah. sorry <laughs> that was sad okay so this is the bathroom it's pretty tight in here but i think that everything should work if anything the sink may be an issue but we could just get rid of that to be honest but yeah that's the bathroom and then here we have their bedroom so they're sharing it because obviously this apartment isn't huge but they do have a computer and I actually made the layout of this apartment off of some blueprints which I've never done before so that was pretty exciting but yes so that's the apartment I like it a lot and I think that it's pretty nice so this apartment is in the spice district or market or whatever it's a really nice brick apartment building and then we will have the spice market thing going on down here hopefully soon and stuff like that but it is just Sunday so we might have to wait a little bit for that but you know that's fine so now we can totally hop into gameplay so I'm just gonna get her to claim this bed before they like just always sleep in each other's beds because I wouldn't mind them having like a personal bed and to start off I think that I'm just going to well, hold on um, oh wait, no, we go check out this thing, right? No? I don't know. I thought that's what you do to see if there's like a festival going on, but I don't know. Oh yeah, okay, we'll leave an affirming note. And then I want to find out... Wait, is there... There's no one available to chat. I want to see which one her brother lives in. Okay, well I don't think anyone lives in that apartment, so let's visit apartment let's go with lavender why not okay so there is a loading screen but I mean it's like it's basically the same thing as if you were to live in Willow Creek or something like that and you went to your neighbor's house like you still have to wait for a loading screen it's not really that different and I know that a lot of people complain about loading screens but personally I don't think they're that bad I mean they do get annoying especially when they take a long time but they're not the biggest deal for me I would rather oh pardon me I'd rather wait through a loading screen than um than have the whole game laggy like 24 7 like the sims 4 or the sims 3 because that is so bad like I can't record that because it's just so slow and it freezes all the time like I can play it a bit but yeah it just it's not great so Okay, why don't we knock on the door? Come on in. Okay, so let's just pause that. Okay, this is not the neighbor that we were looking for. This is Gita Razoya. Okay, then. Well, this is actually a huge apartment. Wow, there's. Is she the only sin that lives here? Because <laughs> that'd be that'd be crazy. Hmm interesting well yeah this is not this is not her brother <laughs> if you didn't know oh there's this one too oh my gosh okay I don't I don't know if our brother lives here if I moved him in but I'm like positive I did is there another sim there oh there is who is this this is Raj Rizoya I think Raj I'm pretty sure it's Raj oh he looks nice 
Okay, well, I think that, to be honest, we're just going to leave because, uh, yeah, we, we weren't trying to go here. So we'll just kind of, I guess, head back home. Yeah, we'll do that. And then I think that we're going to get Lavender to do a little bit of painting, maybe. Oh, I hope I didn't forget to put an easel. Whoops. If I did, then we'll just, like, go the Spice Market kind of area or whatever because I'm pretty sure that there's one there. And maybe Demi can play some basketball or something, or we can try and friend, find her brother. I yeah. If I didn't put him in, then I will put him in off camera when I'm finished recording this part. Oh, it's like 11 o'clock and I'm yawning. That's sad. But like 11 a.m. by the way. But anyway, um, because I'm like I said, I'm like positive that we moved him in. Anyway. Okay, easel, 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 where are you? I think that I forgot to put one. Oh, let's get them jobs before I forget. Oh my gosh, ew, <gasps> that just came in our house. Oh my gosh, if that happened to me in real life, I would die. I'm not even kidding, like that just scared me and I'm playing a virtual game. Okay, I want to take a picture of that because it looks cool. I wish that there wasn't the stupid lines, but anyway. Okay, so... Demi is super, I forgot to mention this, she's like super outgoing, super cheerful, and um, she's a bookworm, she's vegetarian as well, and yes, I want to make a club of these two girls, just like the city living clan, <laughs> and yeah, we'll probably do that later, but her aspiration is leader of the pack, so yeah, we'll have to do that, and that's basically all about Demi. I think I kind of forgot to talk about her, but we are going to get um, Lavender here to get a job, but for some reason, okay. We are going to find a job. I guess we could have done that on our cell phone. We'll do that with Demi, or we could click here. There's just so many options. Okay, here we go. So, um... I don't know if I said this, but I want Demi to have the, what is it called, the social media career, and I want Lavender to have the um, art critic, art critic, not critic, okay, social media. So I have played around with this career a little bit in my current household, but I think that we can kind of do a little bit more with it because we have a giant family, so we don't really have time, but or to like kind of get far in this career so with Demi we'll try and do that and why are we speeding this up okay she never got a career so let's just cancel that let's join a career again okay so she will be a critic and then eventually we'll be able to choose food or art but she only has one day off which is really annoying but she doesn't work for long hours it's just 6 to 11 so that's not too bad Okay, oh, she's Lavender, yes, sure. So we need to level up the writing skill. Okay, we can do that. Oh, is she, is that what she's going to do? I don't know. Let's just write column. No, she's trying to chat. Okay, we'll write a column. That should get our skill up pretty good. This is interesting. Okay, so she acquired the writing skill. Ooh, what are our lot trades? I'm like everywhere in this part, so I apologize for that, but anyway, okay. So, oh, we don't have any. Perfect. So we can go ahead and put any ones we want. So I want one, like the good internet one, because that will help both of them. And I want home studio, and we could do like penny pixies or party place let's do party place because I could see them having quite a few parties so that's good okay there we go because you know what we actually have a lot of space for entertaining so yeah or quite a bit of space at least okay why did she stop did she finish or something I don't understand okay we will write another column I guess I think that that was getting our skill up to be honest, I don't know. Okay. Anyway, we'll see about that in a second. Oh, she wants to create a social media profile, but we have to do that on the computer. So we'll have to wait for that. But yeah, now her skill is going to go up way quicker from the fast internet thingy trait. So that's exciting. 
and that's definitely going to be super helpful. So what does she want to do? She wants to give someone an apartment key, and she wants to share insecurities from being jealous. We probably won't do that. She wants to avenge, evangelize, I don't even know what that means, <laughs> vegetarian benefits with another sim, and she is done. I don't know why I have this sped up. And she wants to give an apartment key as well. Okay. So let's keep, let's just practice writing this time until she gets her skill up and then we'll let Demi um, create her social media profile and then we will head out and kind of go maybe do some karaoke or something. I'm not too sure yet, but we'll do something at least instead of just sitting around in the house. And I love how there's like cars parked out and like, whoops, in the driveway. That's just so cute. I love just the simple, pretty details. It's really... It's really nice. Okay, so she's leveled, leveled, ugh, leveled up in her rating skill. So now we are going to get Demi over here to oh, whoops, create a social media profile. So Lavender, what's that say? Lavender can now self-publish books. Okay. Now let's stop talking. Sorry about that, but I just want her to get this done, and then we can go. Okay, Demi has created a new social media profile. Nobody can go anywhere if in the social media career sphere if they don't have an online presence. Use your social, well, social media profile to gain followers, grow your network, and become an online powerhouse. Okay, so I think that we can actually do a few things here. Yeah, we can maybe update our social media status, and then we will... Um, We'll just quickly check total followers. And then that should be good for now. And it's already 4 o'clock, so yeah. Maybe we'll go out, have some dinner, do some stuff like that. So she acquired the Christmas skill and the comedy. Demi has gained a few followers while updating her social media status. Demi has gained 15 followers. She now has 15 followers in total. Okay. Cool. So, yeah, we are going to travel. We will take them both, maybe, I don't know, to... Oh, wait, no, I don't want to... Oh, I clicked them. Key. No, I wanted to just go down to that area. I forgot that you need to travel. Ugh, darn it. Why? Why? Oh, well, I guess that we will actually go out instead of just going down to that little area because, I mean, we've waited now, so... <laughs> but also, after I record this part, I really want to find my notebook because now it's going to drive me crazy because I had all their storylines kind of written out and some things that I wanted to get done that's kind of about city living so that you guys kind of understand how it works and all that stuff and now I don't have that list so okay we could go to the karaoke bar what is this is this a is this an art gallery I don't know oh no I probably have it probably be in the arts quarter wouldn't it yeah it's right here I think that this is maybe just a house oh yeah Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. The old salt house. Like, obviously. Ugh. Another karaoke bar. We could go to the Sky Fitness Gym. I haven't been in Uptown at all yet. <gasps> Ooh, or we could go to this lounge. I feel like it's kind of early to go there. We'll just actually... Hold on, let's see if her brother does live in here. No, he doesn't. Ugh, I have to move him in. Okay, anyway. Um, does he maybe live in another one? Like, did I put him in a separate? Who's this? No. Um, I'm just going to quickly check. Is this him? No. Uh, that's a karaoke legend. Okay, yeah. I, I think I forgot to. Whoops. <laughs> anyway, um, I think that we will maybe... Hmm. We could... Like... I guess we could just go back to our apartment whoops wrong one so we could stay at our apartment and then and then we will just go to that downstairs area and then later when it's around eight we can go to that um, place in uptown okay so we c we will um, oh let's go look for some snow globes this is how you do it right yeah okay we'll do that and I guess, yeah, we could, like, practice some basketball because there's not really much to do. And then we'll grab a bite to eat and then maybe head over to the, um, to that nightclub thingy. Okay, so we're going to take some close shots. Let's see how she does. I don't even know what her athletic wear is. Oh, no! 
No, we won't. No, no. Oh, from the dusty depths of the free box, Demi has re recovered one Yuma Heights snow globe. Cool, we'll go check that out in a second. But she's going to continue the graffiti, and Demi is going to... Um, she's going to take some shots. Okay, so it's been 20 minutes of this part. I'll probably, maybe next part we'll go to that, like, uptown place because I don't want to, um, I don't want this part to go on forever. And I really don't want to find my notebook. But I want to find it so that I can write down that we have to go to that place next part so that I don't forget. <laughs> okay. So she acquired the painting skill over here. How's it going? Whoops. No. My bad. Okay. I just want to go see. It. Ooh, it looks really good. I love her athletic wear. It's really nice. I forgot that I made it like that. It's really nice. Okay. And she's just shooting some hoops. Oh my gosh. The view. It's so nice. I love it so much. Okay, let's just take some screenshots, obviously. You know, this tree is just beautiful, obviously. Oh my gosh. Guys, like, this is so amazing. Props to the art team, like, 100%. It's just so gorgeous. All the worlds are beautiful, but I gotta admit, the city is probably the best. Like, look at, oh my gosh, the bridge. <gasps> is it gonna light up? Oh, it's so pretty. I love it. Okay, anyway. <laughs> okay, so let's, oh, it's 7-Eleven. No, it's 7-12. Okay, let's try and haggle this woman. I gotta remember that we need to eat vegetarian food. I cannot forget. Okay. Oh, I think she did it, because she's feeling confident. Oh, I took too many screenshots. You drive a hard bargain. Tell you what, I'll give you 25% off. <laughs> okay, so we will order... I don't think... This is vegetarian safe. So far, that's it. I assume that that is, yeah. Um, We'll get the spinach wrapped veggie burrito and I wonder if she'll get the discounted food too no but we can haggle her as well actually let's order from a different food stand if there is one that's open yeah let's go to this one and oh is it just produce hold on let me just check quickly to see because if it's just like one apple or something then we're not gonna go here which I have a feeling that it is so that's unfortunate Okay. Apple blackberries, yeah. Okay, let's just go back over to that other stand and let's haggle a little bit. Yeah, because there's no other food stand, which kind of sucks, but that's fine. I don't mind too much. What did she want to do? She wants to become energized. Hmm. We could probably do that. I love her athletic wear so much. Oh, yeah, she did it too, I think. Yeah, she got 25% off. So let's order discounted food. And we will get the bean and cheese burrito, because I feel like that's definitely something that she would get. I wonder if, just because it's beans, like, you know how Franks and beans makes you fart? I wonder, um, <clears throat> pardon me, if that will happen. Okay, so let's go, oh, it looks like this table's full. I was going to say, let's go sit with, um, with Demi, but that's fine. We'll just go sit here and eat alone. <laughs> that's like me, sort of, not really, but whatever. Oh, is she going to... Oh, she's going to go sit where that guy is. Okay, I was going to get a screenshot of her long. Oh, no, she's not. <laughs> That's sad. Okay, whatever. So, we we got a lot accomplished. It's good, it's good. Got a lot of talking accomplished. But I do want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please let me know in the comments um, what you think about City Living and if you have bought it or are going to buy it. I know I'm a little bit late on the train, but whatever. And also don't forget to subscribe to become part of the Little Llama family. And I'd also really appreciate it if you gave this video a big thumbs up. Anyway, that was like a really different intro but, or outro. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. And I hope to see you next time. Bye, everyone.